So there are two things happening in my little internet bubble, in my sort of sphere of consciousness on the internet. One is the response to Jenna Marble's video in which she slut shames, and the other is the shooting that happened in Connecticut today. To me, there's two things that are sort of linked in this discussion that's happening right now, and that's victim blaming. So most of the responses to Jenna Marble's video have been positive and good um, for, I think, the world. They call her out on slut shaming and they tell you why it's bad and you should go watch those. They're linked in the description. The systemic problem that they are addressing in those videos and those responses is linked, I think, to the conversation that happens around gun control anytime one of these tragedies happens in America. That response often comes from the right wing, the people who are pro-gun, and they say, if everyone had guns, less tragedies like this would happen. In my view, all that says is, it's the victim's fault. It's the teacher's fault for not having a gun in the classroom. It's the student's fault in a tragedy like the one that happened at Virginia Tech. It's the people in the theater's fault that were there in Aurora. There's also some kind of false idea that says if kids are allowed to pray in schools or carry their Bibles that somehow these tragedies would be avoided, that somehow the magical beast in the sky would allow this thing to not happen. But we all know that's not true. Tragedy happens even to the most faithful. The rain falls on both the righteous and the unrighteous. It says it in Job. But this is another example of victim blaming. If the children were praying, or if they were faithful enough, or if the teachers were faithful enough somehow, these tragedies wouldn't happen. Bullshit. It has nothing to do with the government. It has nothing to do with the people who are in the classroom. It has everything to do with the guy behind the gun. My heart goes out to the people in Connecticut today. I have no words. The point of this video is just to remind us that the victims are not to blame here. Their faith was fine. Their ability to pack or not pack heat is not to blame here. But what is to blame is that asshole behind the trigger. In the video description below and also in the video box here that you can see, there are some links to some charities that are helping with victims of gun violence and also some charities that are helping millions of people gain access to mental health help and assistance.